first five metres is probably the, the time where you have to be most most efficient and most explosive as a scrum half, so it's, it's a huge part of my game and, and a huge part of my training. Sometimes it's nice to train on your own, get out in the fresh air, clear your mind, and, and while you're doing that, you're, you're hopefully getting better, you're working on something um, that you're not so good at or you want to improve. For me as a scrum half, to, to get that explosive power and then get into my training, um, a huge amount of drills. There's definitely days where, where you're not motivated to, to get out of bed and, and train and your body might be sore, you might be tired. I always think about my opposition or someone I want to be better than uh, in another team or within my team that I, I know is probably up or, or I know would get out of bed and do that. Good nutrition is becoming massive, massive in, in the professional game and if you eat correctly during the week and you take your supplements properly at the right times, you really feel 100% going into a game and you really feel you can perform. Again, it's going back to your, your competitors, you know everyone else is looking after themselves and, and eating correctly, taking their supplements properly um, at the right times and, and you know they're going to be in a, a good position come the weekend, so, so you, you've got to be like that too. Say 15 years time, if people mention me, um, you know, I, I obviously want to get as many caps as I possibly can. Obviously, want to be known as a, as a quality player, a quality, a quality scrum half. Um, there's been great scrum halves that have played for Ireland throughout the years. You know, I'd like to just be, be mentioned in the same sentence as them.